I just cannot wait. Honestly, the highlight of my year is to come to, to Goa this year. Lonely and forgotten ones, this goes out to the weary. Let's keep dancing while the day is young. This right here is for the sleepless. The fact is, it's about Jesus. We, I am in love with Jesus. I'm not um, a, a, an intellectual speaker. I'm not an intellectual theologian. I am someone simply who loves Jesus and I want people to experience the love that I have experienced. I want people to see that I'm in love with Jesus. That's all. That's all that matters to me. Right, all right. This won't last forever. Let's meet together, let's get excited together, let's serve the Lord together and let's worship God together. This is going to be an awesome and amazing night. It's going to be a time where we, we're going to give excellence to God through our hearts and through our music. I would say come with an open and expectant heart. Not what Father Rob has to give you, but simply about what God is going to do in your life through this event. I believe in miracles, I believe that God is going to heal people even while we're there. God is going to give us this gift of worship, God is going to allow us to encounter Him, His presence there. So come with an open and expectant heart. God is going to do great things and it's going to be a lot of fun. So um, put, bring your dancing shoes on. There's going to be music, there's going to be story. I'm going to share my heart, I'm going to talk about the story of my conversion. I was an addict as a teenager and uh, I was in a really dark place, but I got to experience the light, the love of God. So bring teenagers, bring young people who need to hear this message of redemption, those, your children, grandchildren maybe, who are, are um, struggling with life. Bring your friends, those who need to hear a message of hope. So as a part of our ministry, we, um, we have a, a non-for-profit, a charity that we reach out to teenagers particularly who are self-harming and who are suicidal. But part of what we're doing as well is also justice things. So we're working with Talita Kumi um, ministry in Andhra Pradesh to, to bring um, that work with nuns and we're working with nuns and with a community that help young girls come out of sexual slavery. So we're grateful that we get to do this as well and, and not to profit for ourselves but always to reach out to those who are in need and those who need the dignity and the love of Jesus as much as we do.